Fibromyalgia is referred to as a syndrome, which means that it is a collection of signs, symptoms and medical problems, which tend to occur together but are not related to a specific identifiable cause. It is characterized by widespread muscle pain and fatigue. The word fibromyalgia comes from the Latin term for fibrous tissue, fibro, and the Greek term for muscle, myo, and pain, algia. So it describes pain in your muscles and fibrous tissue, which are your ligaments and tendons. It is a relatively common disorder, which causes widespread pain, aching and stiffness. Women are more likely than men to develop it, and in fact, 9 out of 10 people with fibromyalgia are women. Though it is more common to be diagnosed between the ages of 50 and 70 years, it can affect people of all ages. In some ways, it can appear similar to ME, or chronic fatigue syndrome, but it is quite a separate condition. People with ME usually have less pain and can link the beginning of their symptoms to a viral infection. Fibromyalgia does not affect the joints specifically, so it is not a form of arthritis as such. It can, however, be just as debilitating. It can affect one part of the body or several different areas, such as the limbs, neck and back. There are no outward signs of the condition, and people with fibromyalgia often look well, while feeling quite the opposite. People may not appreciate, therefore, the pain and tiredness that a person with fibromyalgia is experiencing, which can lead to further feelings of frustration and depression. Fibromyalgia is an illness involving both the mind and the body, but there is no suggestion that the symptoms are actually in the mind or imagined. While we don't understand what causes it, there is now a better understanding of the link between the physical and mental aspects of fibromyalgia, and it is clear that the origins of the condition are complex, with a number of possible and interrelated causes. Many people associate the development of fibromyalgia with a physical or emotional trauma such as an accident or bereavement. Worry or stress, brought on by events or relationships at home or at work may also be important factors. In some people it is associated with an illness, and people with rheumatoid arthritis, or lupus for instance, may be more likely to develop fibromyalgia. The amount of pain felt is often affected by the way you are feeling. When you feel depressed, stressed or anxious, the muscular pain may feel worse, which may in turn add to the stress and anxiety. Fibromyalgia varies from person to person, and the type and severity of symptoms you experience may vary greatly, although pain, tiredness and sleep disturbance are the main symptoms. Most people feel the pain of fibromyalgia as an aching stiffness and tiredness in the muscles around the joints. Muscle aching, stiffness and tiredness can vary throughout the day and often gets worse with activity. Simple chores or activities may prove difficult to undertake because of muscular fatigue or lack of energy. Tender points describe particular locations in the body which are a little tender for most people, but where people with fibromyalgia will feel pain in response to even slight pressure. These tender points are used in the diagnosis of fibromyalgia. Research has also shown that people with fibromyalgia experienced increased sensitivity, known as sensitization, to pressure or relatively minor knocks, which would not normally be painful. Other symptoms include fatigue. Many people find that fatigue is the most troublesome symptom. This can make it difficult to do simple things, such as climbing the stairs, doing household chores, shopping or going to work. It can also affect your personal and social life. Waking up feeling unrefreshed is a common problem too, and it also contributes to fatigue. Brainwave studies, called an EEG, recorded during sleep, have revealed that people with fibromyalgia often lose deep sleep. This may be a big contributory factor to the symptoms they develop. In one study, for instance, Healthy people were woken up each time the EEG showed they were in deep sleep. 
than they experienced the typical symptoms associated with fibromyalgia. Poor concentration and memory problems are common, which are sometimes referred to as fibro fog. Poor circulation can cause tingling, numbness or swelling of hands or feet, and irritable bowel syndrome and an urgency to pass urine are also associated. Many people with fibromyalgia can also experience feelings of frustration, anger and emotional upset, including anxiety and depression.